This is a movie, Chipwreck, that's a huge movie, a big, exciting adventure. And so here we are in an exciting adventure with the chipmunks getting to put their handprints and paw prints back in with you know, some of the most successful people in Hollywood over the years. Thanks so much. Uh, this is 50 years in the making. Uh, number one, I wish my dad was here. He created the Chipmunks back in 1958. Well, I remember when my dad first wrote the Chipmunk song, you know, where Alvin sings that, me, I want a hula hoop, that one. And he brought uh, my brother and sister and I in. Take a listen, guys, see what you think. And I loved it from the beginning, mostly because Alvin was talking back to my dad. <laughs> and as kids, you know, we just did whatever our dad told us. So the fact that Alvin was talking back to him that made him my hero. Uh, Janice and I have uh, been continuing that tradition now for quite some time. Well, on our first date, he brought me to his dad's office and he showed me the old cartoons. And he asked me if I thought they would be viable today, if we could bring them back. And I, it was our first date. So I said, well, sure, I'll help you. And it took us about five years, but we finally got uh, a Christmas show on and then doors started to open for us wonderful as we think Alvin, Simon, and Theodore are, they can't be great if they don't have a great David Seville. So having said that, please welcome David Seville, Jason Lee. I mean, that's a, a big deal, right? After 50 years, they deserve that, you know? Maybe after 50 years, I, get, I, 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 can, I can do the same thing and have them come to mind. <laughs> No, I am. You're staying here. I have to go apologize for everything Alvin did. This is so not fair. It was a real challenge to do these movies because you don't have anything to look at, really. Maybe, like, sometimes tape marks or stuffed animals. Um, and to try to make it real was a, a challenge that I wanted to see if I could do, you know, doing the first movie. And then it got easier, and then the second one, and then, and then this one was... Uh, the, the hardest one because there's a lot of action, there's a lot of looking around and a lot of the time you're not looking at anything. And so when you see the movie and it feels very real, it's, it's, it's a nice accomplishment. And he was really great at that because, you know, you don't put the animated character in until all the live actors are finished. So Jason had to see, okay, Alvin is here. No, he just jumped over there. Oh, Simon's over there. Where'd Theodore go? and he had to remember where everyone was moving to. He has to look at nothing and pretend like he's seeing the eye line of these characters. So he was really good at it. Yeah, you know, and the trick is that acting is reacting. And so he had nothing to react to. <laughs> so it took real acting. <laughs> he's been driving me crazy. A lot longer than he's been driving you crazy. Hey, Dave. Alvin. Maybe the next movie they can do some skateboarding. My son is eight and we go skateboarding together. Yeah, it's still very much a part of my life. Well, you know, we do some of the voices, but uh, for the movies, and we used to do all the uh, Alvin, Simon, and Theodore and the Chipettes, but um, now for the movies, Justin Long is Alvin and Amy Simon, Fuller, and, right? Amy Poehler's Eleanor and Christina Applegate is Brittany, and and Anna, Anna Ferris does a great job as Jeanette. So now we just kind of work with the actors to make sure they know how to do the voice and how to do it, and they're it's not so wonderful. easy, by the way. We can't do it without tape speeds and stuff, but it's you know you have you, to yeah. talk like this. <laughs> so that would be Theodore once we speed him back up. Family vacations are all about fun. Relaxing, spending quality time, getting to know each other. First, we're going to need to set some rules. Dave, come on. Rules is my middle name. You know, it's a really, uh, it's an exciting adventure on the high seas where it begins. Alvin, through his little misadventures, winds up taking the whole crew of them, the chipmunks and chipettes, right off the cruise ship and onto a deserted island where they've got to figure out how to survive in the wild and hopefully it's, reunite with Dave. But it's, it's the biggest scope we've ever had, um, but it's still an intimate story. So you still get their personalities, you still get the small story within that family, which is, you know, I think what makes these movies what they are. 
you know, you really get to see Dave caring a lot about his kids and having to do everything he can to find them. So it's a very sweet movie. It's very nice for the family. Let's give a big Alvin on three. Ready, guys? One, two, three. Alvin!